If a tracheostomy tube is blocked or displaced and the patient is deteriorating, then it must be removed. Any ties holding the tube, including any sutures, should be removed and the tracheostomy removed from the stoma, having deflated the cuff earlier in the algorithm. A reassessment then takes place, both at the tracheostomy stoma and at the upper airway, to see if there is gas now moving through either of these airways. Oxygen should be reapplied to the face and to the tracheostomy stoma. A small or paediatric face mask can be applied to the stoma, or a laryngeal mask can be used. The water circuit provides additional clues to the adequacy of ventilation, and capnography should also be attached.